Baseball, Aaron. I mean, that was my first time because in Turkey, like, we don't have we, we don't have that sport. Like, I was excited, but I did practice here like a couple minutes, but it was it, it was easy. I can't do that. <laughs> Were you nervous? Uh, yeah, I was nervous. I was nervous. How did you feel about the way you delivered the ball? Did you like your pitch? I mean, they, uh, the coach tried to teach me a little bit, but it's too hard. <laughs> Before game, I, I try to do a uh, tennis ball, but I, it's, it's, too, it's too hard. <laughs> Ennis, what, what are you doing now, kind of in preparation for, for the draft? Uh, I mean, I'm just, right now, I'm just trying to uh, finish my class first, and then after my class, probably I will go to Chicago, and then uh, try to get ready for draft with uh, Tim Growers. How, how well prepared do you feel? I mean, I mean, I feel so like I feel so like right now because uh, like everything has happened and I didn't give up and then I just finished my school. I, I, I was about to like, I'm gonna finish my school first and then I will go to draft. Like, how how anxious are you to play a game again to play basketball? Again? I mean, like. I hope next year finally I can play, like I can step on the court, like it's really excited because my last game was like Coupe Summit last year, like mm -hmm. it was like April, like almost a year ago. Mm -hmm. Right now I'm really excited, you know. How, what was it like for you, the whole waiting for a decision? I mean, it was hard, it was it just, and it just made me sad, but you know, my teammates told me, my coaches, everybody told me, you know, you, you cannot give up, you know, you have to uh, you have to keep working hard and then I just try to keep working hard and try to help my teammates and try to help my coaches and, uh, you know, Kentucky, everything. Was it hard? I mean, when they get to the Final Four, do you think, you know, if you could have played this year that, that you guys could have won the whole thing? Uh, yes. <laughs> How did you feel watching Josh do so well? I mean, Josh is just amazing, you know, I mean, me and him just all, like always working at the gym after practice, before practice and before, uh, Ohio State game. He uh, in the practice. He told me that, and then said he will do. He will try. I, I will try my best. And then I just said I believe you. And then I uh, and then he just did a, like he just did a great job. You know. He said that he gave you a, a ton of credit for getting him ready, and so did Brandon. I. How did that make you feel when you heard them talk about you from the podium and things like that? I mean, just great. You know, it's like Final Four. Like that's it. Coach Cannon. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> How did you like coaching? I mean, coach is. It's hard, <laughs> really hard. Like, why? Uh, because like, I don't know. I didn't actually coach. I just took like stats or something. But I can't understand Coach Carr right now. It's like so stress or you know everything. <laughs> Do you have any aspirations to be a coach at some point? Uh, no. <laughs> I would say no. <laughs> with the draft coming up, does it matter where you go? Who you yeah. go with? I have no idea, I, like, it doesn't matter, like, I would just try to do my best, you know? I would just try to show everybody, like, because no one see me when I play yet, so I have to show everybody, you know? Do you have a preference, big city, you know, a place like Indiana, I mean, New York? Where, I it mean, it, I said it's like, it doesn't matter, you know? Uh, I just want to go and then play in the, in the team, you know? It doesn't and matter. They're yeah. saying you're going to be a lottery pick. If you haven't played, like you said, mm -hmm. in more than a year, what do you think of that? I mean, I'm, like, it's not, I don't know yet I'm going to be lottery or not, but I'm just, like, in draft workouts, I'm just going to try to do my best. And it's, what, what if there's a lockout and you have to wait longer again to play? I mean, I don't, yeah, there is a chance like that, but I didn't think, I didn't think yet. Mm -hmm. Do you understand why the NCAA wouldn't let you play? Why wouldn't they let you play? I mean, like I didn't think I did some, I didn't think I did something bad. You know, I just like I just came here for school. I just came here for education, and then like, uh, when, like I was like when I'm in Turkey, I was only 14, 15, and 16 years old. You know, and I didn't know anything. You know, like I didn't like. Like when I when I was 14, 15, 16, so like I didn't understand what money was, you know, because I, I always like take money from my dad. So even though you didn't get a chance to play here, how do you feel about the time you spent in Kentucky? I mean, Kentucky is just amazing, you know. Kentucky fans, like er like everything is unbelievable, you know. Like after that, like my in ineligible Kentucky fans are just still support me, keep supporting me. It's just amazing, amazing to me.
Do you have one of those free Anna's uh, shirts? Uh, <laughs> no, I don't have one. Do you have a pair of jorts? Huh? Do you have a pair of jorts? Uh, yeah, I have one. I have jorts. <laughs> Where? Uh, no. <laughs> when you see the, the, the way the fans have reacted to you, do you wish, I know you wish you could play for them, but how much more would they have reacted to you had they seen you on the court? I mean, like, I wish I can, like I wish I can play. Like, I wish I could play and I, like help my teammates, help my coaches at the University of Kentucky. But I couldn't play. But I just still try to like help them. You know, like uh, I just like try to help Josh or other big men or I just you know. The fans made such a big deal out of you with the under canter. And oh everything. yeah. <laughs> Had you played though, what do you think their reaction would have been like to you even more than what it has been? Uh, if I play, I don't know. <laughs> I will be a little bit more. <laughs> <laughs> Last one. Mm -hmm. you Are you back? thinking about playing baseball again? <laughs> uh, no, it's fun to watch, but I don't want to play. <laughs> I saw you talking to Alex Meyer. He was a great basketball player too. Really? So it can be done. He, yeah. he, like, I asked him. He, I asked him, and they said he's a like great, uh, great uh, pitcher, and then. He's fast, he's, he's like 98, 90 or something like that. I asked him, how about mine? They, they sound like 30 or 20. <laughs> so there's room for improvement. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Anna. Thanks, Anna.